everybody, Victoria Marie here, producer director of Gray is the New Blonde, and today I am going to be discussing how you can see the film, when you can see the film, and where you can see the film. So first, let me address when. I have been saying all along that the movie is going to be released by year's end. And in thinking about it, I want to have a red carpet event here in LA. And I realize people are going to be flying in from different parts of the country. I don't know, maybe the world. That would be something, huh? And during the holiday season, we'll say New Year's, people are busy with other plans. So then I started thinking, well, then January, but then it occurred to me, the only place that it's really nice in January is here. But people flying in may incur some very bad weather, and I really did not want that to happen. So I decided to push it to on or about March 2nd, which is where, which is when, the when, we will have the red carpet premiere here in LA. Now I say on or about March the 2nd because the theater has not been solidified, so that still is in the works. It might be March 1st, it might be March 3rd, it might be the following weekend, but we're gonna see. Saturday is March 2nd. Sunday's March 3rd. That's my birthday, so <laughs> I'm kind of especially motivated to have it on March 2nd, but I have to see. This way, anyone who is flying in from the east most likely won't incur bad weather, so we'll see, but that's the plan. Then another uh, red carpet event in New York about two months later, we'll say around May. Um, I may do North Carolina first. My parents live there and I would like for my parents to be able to be a part of this and the rest of my family. And then New York City. I have gotten a lot of emails from people saying they would like to show it in their hometown or where they live and they have access to a movie theater. So I am working with a company that can actually facilitate many showings, many, um, and I'm thinking one night only showings in different cities throughout the U.S. And the way it works is someone who lives in that city would be the event host and they would be basically be coordinating it. And what's the, the beauty of this is that we uh, announce that it's going to be showing on such and such a date at such and such a theater, and then it gives people in that area an opportunity to pre-purchase, or I shouldn't say purchase, I should say reserve a ticket. And if enough tickets are sold, and they don't even need that many, but enough t tickets are sold, and based on the response from the trailer, I believe that plenty of tickets will be sold and there might be a, a need for an additional night. Um, then they move forward and they actually confirm those sales and the date is set in stone and the theater, and these are like Regal Theaters, AMC, so these are very high-end theaters. So having said that, if you think that you would like to be an event host for your area of the country, your city, please let me know. There will be some cities that I will be doing, uh, going to the showing and Dave and I, and potentially uh, some of the other members of the team, we would go to some of the cities and be there for after the showing, do a Q&A, which would be great. Which would I've been to Q&As here in LA, and they are fantastic because you kind of get to see a behind the scenes look of what the whole process was like. The other option, and this is the really exciting part because I know that there are thousands, I want to say millions of women across the world who cannot come to the U.S., who are not in the U.S., but they want to see the movie. So um, I have decided I'm going to have DVDs made. Um, 
And for those of you who are um, signed up to the newsletter from my website, you've already received a private link about eight days ago to where you could purchase this ahead of time. And now with this video and this update and announcement, I'm making it available to the public. That's my kitty cat. <laughs> I don't know why. Every time I do a video, I've got three. One of them, Bogart. He gets a little wild. Anyway, so um, I am going to have a limited number of DVDs printed up, numbered, and you can choose between just numbered or numbered and signed by me. Uh, so there's a link on my website. Now I kept it hidden up until this video just as a, an offer to the people who have already signed up to the newsletter from the website. And now with the release of this video, I'm making it, um, I'm unhiding it and I'm making it available to everyone. So if you know of anyone who wants to see this film and they're not here in the States, please share this video. And I'm going to put the direct link below this video so that it'll bring you right to the page on my website that gives you the option to make the purchase of either the uh, numbered or the numbered and autographed. And I can tell you that the response has been phenomenal and most people are uh, choosing the numbered and autographed. And the third way, although this is kind of down the line, that's Netflix. I love Netflix. I watch a ton of stuff on Netflix and Netflix is highly curated. They usually say no to almost all independent uh, filmmakers. However, they do like documentaries and they like niche documentaries. This is a niche for sure obviously. So, um, but I'm not going to approach them just yet. I have to work with an aggregator and um, just to submit it to an aggregator because Netflix doesn't talk and communicate with independent filmmakers. They talk and communicate with aggregators who talk with the filmmakers and the aggregator prepares the film because there's a lot of hoops you have to go through as even for the, to show it on, um, to show it in the movie theaters. There's lots of preparation that has to be done. Uh, but the aggregator prepares the film, uh, actually first vets the film and says, okay, this is something that Netflix, sh Netflix should see. So they're like the first line of defense. They're kind of the gatekeepers for Netflix. And then if they say, yeah, we want to submit this to Netflix, there's no guarantee Netflix is going to say yes. Anyway, I'm going to conclude the video. I think it's gone on long enough. And I, I know you guys probably want to get to see, um, you want to pre-order the DVDs. And um, I think that's it for now. So, ciao for now.